My name is Marcus Anthony, and I'm a photographer. Why do I do what I do? Well, I'm an artist. It seems weird saying that now, but the more I do what I do, the more I realize that's exactly what I am. I must create. It's something I've always had a passion for, and it's something I think I'll continue to do until the end of my days. Being a photographer is something that allows me to add value to the lives of others. And I think that's really important in life. Being able to contribute something to the world is something that drives me. If I'm not constantly coming up with ways to help people, I either get bored or I almost feel guilty. It's something that's inside me that I can't silence. I think there's an inherent duty in all photographers that we must give a full service to our clients. In recent years with the rise of digital, it's so easy to just send over an online gallery and say, here you go, download these files. But I want to go two steps further. I want to invite my clients back into my studio. I want to give them an experience of watching their slideshow of all the images that we created on their wedding day, or of their child, or of their family. And I want them to watch that on an 80 inch screen with a projector. I want them to see the images larger than life so that they can enjoy them. The second part of that is delivering their wall art. Wall art to me is the pinnacle of professional photography. If you're not selling wall art, it's a disservice to your clients. Having digitals is very convenient. It's a great way to share with friends and family who might not live close to you. But to get the true value out of professional photography, you're not paying for the digitals. You're not paying for the convenience of being able to share on Facebook. You're paying for the decades of value that you're getting out of your wall art. When you wake up and you see that beautiful canvas hanging over your mantle. When you're having a bad day and you walk down the hall and you see a few prints you got of your children 10 years ago, 20 years ago, it'll make you stop and think. We're selling memories. We're not selling pictures. We're selling emotions, really. At the end of the day, we're selling emotions. And to not give my client that experience is not something I'm interested in. 